If you want to connect your external hard drive to iPad, in between this you just need this OTG. For me, it's iPad 10th gen, so I'm going to use this USB-C OTG. I will give this product link in the description. It's Amazon link. If you wish, you can buy that. Now, just take your hard drive and it's connecting cables. And just connect the cable as it is. Just like that and take the USB end. And just connect this into your OTG like this. Then connect this old setup into your iPad charging port. Connect like this. If it doesn't work or connect, flip this end. Then try to connect. Hopefully it works. Now here you can see the indication light on hard drive. If it blinks, your iPad and hard drive are connected for file transfer. For USB-C port iPad, you don't need the hub or any other fancy adapter like this. You don't need this stuff. You just need this OTG and it's ready to go. Even it works for large file transfer too. I tested everything, works fine. Now I just place like this. Then open files. And here you can see my password which is my WD 2TB hard drive. First thing, just long press over your hard drive and click get info and format here you can see it's xfat if it shows ntfs first thing you need to format your hard drive to xfat then only you can transfer files from ipad to hard drive or, or vice versa so you don't need to worry about just again click again long press over your hard drive and click erase and uh, you can choose any of this option. I just leave it for XFAT and click erase and confirm that. Now here you can see it's formatted to XFAT. Now you are ready to move the files. If you already have storage on your hard drive, you need to take backup on by using PC or Mac. On Windows PC, it works fine. If it is a Mac, you need to install NTFS driver to support this hard drive so that's the thing let's transfer files if you want to transfer from files app to hard drive i just open this and click select and select the photos and videos you can choose move or click more and click copy then your hard drive and click this to create folder and just give any name and click done then open that and long press here and just paste here you can see the photos and videos are transferring right now it's completed so let's move from hard drive to gallery or files i just open the hard drive and click select and select all and share or you can click move and copy to files and if you click share you just directly copy this to gallery so choose save items and click done and gallery and recent photos here you can see it's transferring one by one right now and this is basically how you need to do now i just minimize this and close the recent to eject this you need to close the recent all reasons and you can unplug like this if you want more safety, turn off your iPad and disconnect the cable and just remove like this. That's it. You are ready to use. And for below iOS 18, you doesn't see the erase option on your drive. So you need to watch this video.